Apple's tvOS has gotten to be actually pretty amazing lately with the new tvOS 17 update. Now, tvOS has actually been pretty neglected since it was released with the Apple TV HD, or the fourth generation now. So, I actually have one back there up with my TV, and I use it every night. And I decided to install the beta on it because the developer beta was free this year, and I kind of just said, no, what, let's see what it's about. So, to start off, we have a home screen that's similar to the old one we had, but we actually get an extra row. So, instead of having five rows across, we have now have six. And this is really nice because when you have a bigger TV, it's kind of annoying to have the apps just have five, and this is something I said with iPad OS 17, and Apple seems to be listening for tvOS, but not iPad or iOS, but that's a topic for another day. Now we also have a new control center, so this is actually amazing as it shows you the time, the ability to power it off, the ability to have the Wi-Fi, do not disturb, sleep timer, a few accessibility options, um, to set a lock if you need to lock it for whatever reason. Um, AirPlay devices as well as a game controller setting. So these are all pretty cool changes and options and you also have the ability in the kind of like a stays up in the top right and it floats around. It says the time, the home status if you have smart devices uh, as well. So it's all pretty nice features. Now we also got FaceTime. So this is one of the big features that I'm very excited for because using continuity camera on your iPhone or your iPad, you can prop it up by your Apple TV and use it for a FaceTime call. So just like you can with Mac OS, you can connect your iPhone and use that as your camera. So you can use your TV as the big screen and allow everyone to be in the picture and everything will be done by your iPhone. And now Apple has also added this continuity camera API to all of them. But the Apple TV 4K, the new one, the third generation, has some new features like karaoke with Apple Music Sing with the ability to see yourself on screen and your friends with some cool visual effects, which is pretty cool. Now, we also have the ability to find your Apple TV remote using Find My. So this isn't out just yet, but if you have a second generation Siri remote or later, so not this one, which has the buttons, the menu button, and all of these buttons, which I'm actually a very big fan of this remote, but we do not get Find My support for this one, but you do for the other ones. So it kind of works like an AirTag where you can move it around. While you can't play a sound, you can move it around to help you pinpoint it, which I think is so cool because it'll help you find the remote when it gets stuck in the couch cushions or lost in bed or just dropped on the floor. Now, it does also have the additional features that come over from iOS, such as Apple Fitness Plus with custom plans, and some other ones, so we do also have Enhanced Dialog, which Apple HomePod second generations. And we also do get some third-party support for VPN. And what's great about tvOS 17 is it actually doesn't drop support for any of the devices that currently support tvOS 16. So, if you have an Apple TV fourth generation like I do from a while ago, it still works. And that's one of the great things with the tvOS is Apple doesn't seem to be dropping support for any of them anytime soon. And I'm okay with that because that thing has put on so many iOS, so many tvOS versions, and I'm absolutely loving it because it is absolutely amazing. Now, tvOS has come a long way from where we used to be. So the third generation, or the one I had before this, you couldn't download apps, you couldn't have an app store, you couldn't have, have these features. And now we have an app store, FaceTime, we're getting even more features from these devices. And I bought that five, six, seven years ago now, and it's great, and it, Apple is adding more features to it, and I'm absolutely loving it. So, if you're running tvOS 17, or you have a favorite feature that was brought over from tvOS, let me know in the comment down below, and while you're down there, if you want to hit the like and subscribe button, I'd also really appreciate that as well, as let me know you're enjoying this content. Now, I want you to remember, today's a good day to make a great day, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Peace.